welcome to the channel, Living in Denver, Colorado. If this is your first time here, make sure you go ahead and subscribe to like, the channel. Like, comment. Yep, ring that little bell. We're doing videos every single day, everything Denver, Colorado. But today we're going over B uh, Bear Creek Lake. Sorry. Bear Creek Lake. We're going fully I, in depth. I got scared. <laughs> I <was> like... <laughs> Bear Creek Lake. We're going to go through it, show you everything it has to offer. You're not going to want to miss number seven, so stick around. Also, don't forget, Jason and I are licensed real estate agents here in the state of Colorado. So if you guys have any real estate questions, don't uh, hesitate to give us a call. Our number will be right here at the bottom. Bam. Oh, right down here. There we go. Yep. <laughs> yep. Number one. One. Are, are we doing that? Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. All right, step. Okay. Number one <laughs> is the visitor center. So <laughs> as you kind of come into the park, there's a visitor center there. Um, you to get into the park is ten dollars a person. Um, and then I'll, I'll post the I'll post the, the the link below too. It gives you all the information. But um, Loves ten links. bucks for a whole car, um, and then. Once you hear about all the things it has to offer, it's way worth the 10 bucks. Yeah, well, um, the visitor center, you can also get, um, you know, a yearly pass to where, you know, you can go anytime you want. Um, but, yearly? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, it has a lot of informational pieces there, gives you some trail maps, shows you and, and tells you a lot of the things that you can do there. Um, and yeah, so make sure you stop off there first. That's number one. You got to get all your information before you get out there. Yep. Otherwise, you'll just be walking around just confused. Yep. <laughs> all right. Uh, the second one that we're going to go over. Number two. Two. Uh, number two. Okay. Uh, we're going to do uh, the beach. The beach, obviously, around the lake. It's a cool beach. It's a cool beach. There's really cool stuff. There's playgrounds that are over there, and there's places that you can do little picnic tables and that kind of stuff. It's actually kind of cool. Yeah, you know, being landlocked in Colorado, having some kind of water, familiar <laughs> water or, you know, familiar beach um, is really cool. You know, you kind of forget that you're even in Colorado at times, you know, so. Um, <laughs> you just want to get in the water and swim, don't you? Just... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, so, yeah, there's a cool beach. Um, you can bring the bring the family, do some picnics, um, even have host uh, parties there. Yeah, um, absolutely. So, great place to go. Number three. 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 <laughs> Three. Go ahead, tell. Got it. Tell them what it is. Oh, sorry, we're doing boat rentals, guys. So yeah, right <laughs> past the beach. You'll go right past the beach, and there's a little um, place where you can rent boats, boats, kayaks, paddle boards. Um, you can also reserve those too. So if you you want to plan in advance and make sure that you have one allocated to you and your family, um, it's always good to reserve one. And uh, we'll leave that link in the description. So go ahead. Do you know if they have a maximum boat size you can take? A maximum boat size? Yeah. yeah. They don't have like boat boats, but you know, like small canoes, maybe like a little Johnny boat. Maybe. Oh, so you can't take one with like a blown V8? No. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's all non-motorized actually. So yeah. But we'll post that down here. <laughs> Josh will. <laughs> <laughs> so he wants to know, but that's super cool. Um, you can bring your own too as well, and you know, take take advantage of the the lake there. This is arm powered only. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, arm powered. No no V8 <laughs> engines, Josh. Lame. Up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yep. So that's number three. All right, number four. Number four. What is it? Number four is, it? is archery. Oh, okay. Believe it or not, they have an archery range. Yeah, so actually Super it's pretty cool. cool. Uh, the archery range is completely free. Uh, you get to shoot at targets, and actually a lot of the archery schools actually go there to do training. Yeah, kind of cool. Yeah, we got yeah, like you said, a lot of schools go there. They got like classes you can take. Um, you can bring just bring your own bow and just go shoot at the at the targets. Bugs. Um, but yeah, I mean that's a cool resource that they have out there. That's free. Um, could be very um, eventful for the kids and. And oh, for the parents too, yeah, I guess. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> We're gonna be real honest about that. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> so archery. Number five. 
it's horseback riding. Yeah, you can literally go ride a horse. Ride a horse. Yeah, they, <laughs> they got horse rentals. They they kind of show you there. Um, I've only ridden a horse once. Really? Yeah. Oh, that's super cool. I was very little. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Somebody had to walk with me. Yeah, but it's a cool thing to take your family. Um, you know, you can rent the horses. They'll show you, and they got really cool trails that bring you throughout the whole park. Um, you know. I'm actually almost willing to do that. I think I would take my daughter to do that. It's kind of kind of like, like horsepower, dude. You know, yes, it's kind of horsepower. Good. Yes. I've never seen him really go really fast. It's probably like a really slow trot. It's like a Honda. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, um, but super cool um, to be able to do that. You know, we're kind of going in the whole little theme here. This whole park is like a family. It's a big family thing. Family thing that where you can you can spend all day or even days there um you know because so. you can camp there boom you boom. Just bust it out number six man sorry number six so yeah just like josh camp. said <laughs> they got awesome campsites there and guess what go ahead tell them tell them josh. they got yurts they got super they got cool yurt, yurts. super cool yurts and actually when you rent out the yurts you get like your own private campsite um, one has like a huge parking lot where you can, you know, have a lot of family there. <laughs> you know, maybe you have the kids stay in the tents and you and, you know, mom and dad stay in the yurt or something, you know, or... Yeah. Maybe. I only found out about a yurt two days ago, so... Yep, you get your own private, like, picnic table. There's also a grill there as well. Um, but, you know, as far as the campground goes, there are, um restrooms with showers um and there's also um places to clean out your rvs and all that good stuff too yeah so you get really taken care of when you go to these things and it's just it's just good old-fashioned family fun yes Heck yeah. Yeah. Heck all right. yeah all right all right i think we're at like number seven now seven we're seven definitely seven and what are we it's probably in every one of our videos every single one of these videos because of done. colorado it has hiking and biking hiking and biking i mean <laughs> seriously that's why probably Denver is probably one of the most fit, fittest cities in the country. Sun's out, guns out. Yep, yes. yep. Because, um, yeah, there's so much <laughs> you know, activities to do with the hiking and biking. This park, with a 2,600 acre park, offers paved... It's like 90 miles of trails! <laughs> <laughs> Josh should be sitting at the picnic table. <laughs> Having a beer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But, um, you know, they have paved, paved trails and they have unpaved ones. So it's, it's you know, different skill levels, um, you know, for bringing the kids. Or, you Where's know. the beginner one? <laughs> yeah. It's With, to the car. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So um, hiking and biking, they got, you know, tons of trails. Um, we'll leave the trail guide down here in the description below. <laughs> and then um, also, along with all the trails, the hiking and biking there's also a lot of fishing um good fishing spots there as yeah, well absolutely um well, let's just roll into number eight then um, let's do it you can have um they have reserved like picnic table covered picnic table areas oh for, yeah those are really um, nice for yeah. parties mm -hmm. um has you know really big parking lot so you can have the whole family there you know uh, for any kind of you know celebrations that you might have um and they have a lower one there by the water. They got several different ones, but usually they have like a, you know, a volleyball net to, to play volleyball, horseshoe pit. Um, they do um, have, you know, plenty of picnic tables for everybody and the grills and everything is already out there. And picnic tables. And, and the picnic tables. And the picnic tables. I mean, oddly enough. There's picnic tables. They have like, they have picnic tables. <laughs> you know, where you can sit. And do picnics. While, while, everybody, <laughs> while everybody's hiking and biking. <laughs> You're picnicking. <laughs> He's picnicking. <laughs> Thanks, All guys, right. for watching our video. Uh, living in Denver, Colorado. Um, really hope you guys watch these videos and really enjoy them. And uh, we really enjoy doing them as much as you guys like watching them. So mm -hmm. if you guys have any questions, comments, um, maybe where you want us to go next, don't forget to leave a comment down at the bottom. Also, make sure you subscribe so you see every new video that we're coming out with. Uh, Jason and I are also licensed real estate agents here in Denver, Colorado. So if you guys are moving here or thinking about moving here and want to relocate, let us know. We'll help you out. We'll make the transition easy and smooth. Smooth and easy. <laughs> and fun, too. <laughs> yeah, we, we appreciate you guys watching. Thanks. We appreciate you guys watching. And you guys have a good night.